So loads of you guys are always asking me, what lip combo are you wearing? What lip is that? So I'm gonna show you. My lips need a bit of a TLC because I don't know about you guys, but this weather, no. My lips literally look like I've grabbed Gandhi's flip-flop and just First of all, we're gonna use some Charlotte Tilbury Magic Scrub. Does nothing, but feels good. It smells like a mixture between watermelon cucumber and Savlon arse. So now they should be feeling like numb from the pain. I always use Carmex or Vaseline, but I love Carmex. Just smells lethal, like should this stuff be going on my mouth? Who knows? <laughs> I've got a lot of stuff in my mouth. I always want to have moisturised lips before you go in with the lip liner, otherwise it just goes so scrapey and just gross. You want to have nice... Of course, I'm going to take my baby cork from MAC. Now, the lip liner is going to work best when it's at this kind of length. You don't want it super sharp, you don't want it super blunt. Ignore her. She's new. She's just been popped and she squirted onto the wardrobe. It was euphoric. Anyway, enjoy this segment of me doing my lip liner. So I've been loving this Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick in the shade Blush at the moment for this season. I feel like it, it looks quite pinky on camera. When you put it on, it's not like it's got a brown undertone and I'm obsessed with brown. I absolutely love brown undertones. Today I'm going to take Loyalist from the Maybelline 24 Hour Superstay Matte Inks. Got a little bit of that there. And then you're going to want to tap that out. And then we're going to take the NARS Gloss in Broken Glass and we're just going to pop it over the top. This is, this might seem a bit glam to you guys, but for me, this is my everyday lip. There you go, lovelies. 